Hey guys, what's up? So today I am going to be sharing four tips with you guys that truly helped me grow my hair out. Um, a little backtrack, I cut my hair up to here when I was around nine years old, I think. I was in fifth grade, I don't really know the age, to be honest with you. Um, but these four tips truly helped my hair grow from here to up to my shoulders and now... Well, here's my belly button, so it's like pretty close to my belly button. And it got my hair a lot thicker and longer. So if you guys want to know these tips, just keep on watching. Okay, so the first tip I have is to use no heat. Now I know this is pretty basic and it's actually kind of hard to follow because if you're like me, you really like your hair straight or sometimes people like it really curly, it just depends. The only problem with heat is it damages your hair and the key to getting long hair is to have healthy hair. And that's what I followed, that kind of motto of if you really, really want long hair, you have to have healthy hair. So in order to do that, when I cut my hair, I cut it around September before I went back to school. And when I was entering sixth grade, I remember it was like kind of around my shoulders. I don't remember it was exactly here, but it was like around that area. And it grew a lot because I just threw my hair like into a pony or a bun and not use absolutely any heat. The second tip I have is that you guys use coconut oil. Uh, I think you can purchase this pretty much at any grocery store. And this helped my hair in quite a few ways, actually. The number one way is it made my hair very, very strong. And that's a very, very important step because, again, strong, healthy hair is what's going to get you very long and nice hair. And it also helps because around the winter time, I, when I was trying to grow my hair up, I had very, very, a very, very dry scalp, so that helped with that quite a lot. And it kind of just gave a calm, cooling effect. And the third tip I have for you guys is to use yogurt. Now I'm not saying go get your yolk plate and plop it on top of your head. I'm saying go to your grocery store and go where the yogurt section is and pick up a container of Greek yogurt. Now what Greek yogurt is going to do, what I like to do is put it on, kind of really get into my scalp and then wash it off and then use shampoo and conditioner and you know, all that stuff. And what this does is, one, it made my hair super, super soft. And it also helped kind of, because I was massaging it kind of like a hair mask, it helped the circulation and that really helped it grow. And it also made it very, very, very soft, which was also a bonus because who doesn't like soft hair? And the fourth and final tip is that you guys, every, I think it's like three or six months, you are supposed to get a trim. Now, if you're like me and you've gotten your hair up to a certain length and you're like, no, I don't want to cut it. That's, that's me currently. Get a dusting. And that is what I got done at the salon a, I think a couple years ago. I think it was like two years ago. I truly am gonna be honest with you guys. I don't get trims or dustings that often, but this did help in the process to grow my hair. But this really is a alternative if you do not want a trim because they don't take off as much hair because in a trim, I know they take off, they say, oh, we'll take off a little amount, but they end up taking off like a couple inches and then you were just like, I feel you 100%. I hope these tips helped you guys out. And if you use these tips, just comment down below if they helped. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to you guys later.